Sure. I mean, friendships are just hard to go. I, I saw where, tell, didn't Telly Blanchard say something smart about me in, this weekend? Um, yeah, maybe a little bit. Yeah. What, what did he say again? The, uh, I'm sure we can find the exact quote, but the gist was, uh, he thinks he's done with wrestling. He thinks that now AEW and WWE are in his rear view mirror. And, uh, he says, you know, there's more to it than that, but we'll just leave well enough alone talking about his sort of AEW exit. And then he said he thought at this point, you know, his wrestling career was over. Maybe he'll do some appearances here or there, but quote, I don't know how many more last matches Ric Flair can have. That's sort of oh, thing. I thought he, I thought he said I embarrassed myself. I'm sorry if he, if he didn't say that. Well, I think he was saying he didn't want to embarrass himself. Oh, okay. Well, then I, I totally yeah, I understand that totally. I thought it was the other way around. Yeah, he, he was. Uh, there you go. I didn't see it and I wasn't there. The show was on Sunday and I had to be at my day job. The one that pays all my bills and on the offers he's received to get back in the ring. Uh, probably, I would probably not comment on that because I probably don't have a lot of positive to say. I was asked to do a last match with Ricky steamboat. I'm not going to embarrass myself and go out there and not be able to do what I used to do. Oh, see, that's how the headlines always turn around. I thought you had said something negative about me. Well, I mean, I think, you know, the implication that could be strong as negative is, oh, Flair's having too many retirement matches, but I didn't think that was a serious slight. Oh, okay. no, it, no, now that you read it like that, it's fine. That's why I'm glad we clarified. Yeah. No, hey, I, 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 I tell you what, I wouldn't recommend it again either. And, and I, I don't know why they keep saying I'm begging for their match. What I have said to you repeatedly, I wish I could redo that match. Yes. I'm not begging for another match. I don't want to wrestle again. I have no desire. I wish I had that match to do over again is what I've said repeatedly, but these idiots turn it into <laughs> he's begging for another match. I mean, God, it, it, it's it, the translation of our comments. Sometimes are just, it's, it's ridiculous. Well, what's, um, what's happening is there's no context to it and, and they're not seeing you laughing and joking and yeah, no, I mean, I just wish I could redo that. And then what they leave out, are the comments like what we discussed last week that it trended number one on da 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 right? Then I take it. You got to. I mean, it's like no matter how I look at it, and you can I can be criticized for forever. I I that match should have been so much better in Nashville. Oh, he could have written a fucking twenty five page book about that match. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. He maybe he did. I don't. I'm not aware of it, but. God, for all the time and effort we put into that for me to, to get dehydrated, man. Well, let's make it very clear again. I do not want to wrestle again. I wish I could redo that match. <laughs> dumb asses. Well, I'll tell you what, you'd have to be a dumb just, ass. Just print that. that. <laughs> there you go. 